guys, how's it going? It's Like Horse Lover 200 here again with another video. And this is going to be the long awaited for barn tour of Silver Star Stables for 2018. And yeah, so I'm super excited. But before we get started, I just want to let everybody know that this barn I set up is a lot smaller than the one I used to have before I moved. And the reason it's so small is because I don't have the room right now to set up a really big barn. So this is what I have set up right now. Um, if you guys want to see everything I have, all the other horses I have, and all the other slight things, comment down below if you want to see a collection tour. So I can make a collection tour if you guys want to see all that stuff. But yeah, so anyways, let's get into the barn tour because I know you guys have waited a long time for this. So we're going to start here at the beginning with the sign. So I just made this a few days ago and it turned out really nice, I think, anyways. So it says Silver Star Stables and then it just lists everything that we offer. So we have training, boarding, shows, breeding, and more. And then the sign is just held up by these two flower pots. And then over here, we have a watering can. And then out back of the sign, we have our stallion paddock. So here we have Silverton, our Camarage stallion. And he is wearing a blanket by Aqua Models. And then this is Wind, Dan Wind Dancer, our Pinto stallion. And he is wearing a stable set that I made actually, so it's really pretty on him. And then this here is Trickster, um, that's his sheet, and he's usually out there here in this paddock, but he's being ridden right now. And then here we just have some feed, and then we have um, this fence that obviously separates the stallions and the mares. So this here is the mare side, so, um, Let's see, we have a water trough, and this actually I got out of a briar set, but I find it works really good with likes. So this here is Tilta, and she is our Tennessee Walker mare, and she is wearing a blanket that I made once again. And then this here is Minnie, and she is an Isolanic pony mare, and she is wearing a stable set by, uh, I believe it's GHS Tack Shop. So it is super cute. And then of course they also have some feed. And then this here is Crystal and she is a thoroughbred mare and she belongs to Sophie and she's wearing a blanket by me. And then this here is Sophie and she is going to feed her horse some carrots and Crystal is super excited. And I almost forgot to mention, um, right here we just have some random pieces of grass that I made out of clay. Um, I just threw them out here in the pasture. Those are actually from a long time ago. So yeah, but anyways, over here, so um, we have some tack boxes. So we have two of them, and on top we have a bareback pad that was made by Gabby Valet Tack Shop, I believe is how you say it, and a riding crop, which is really old as well. And then, so in the first tack box, uh, we just have a whole bunch of extra grooming kits that we're not using right now. Um, so we just have a few that I made, and then there's one like one in there. So those are just extras. And then in the second tack box, we have a whole bunch of saddles and bridles and basically just everything. So we have a saddle in here by Rocky Mountain Stables, one by Schleich Horse Girl 11, and we have some polo wraps by Gabby Valet Tech Shop and a whole bunch of other stuff by me. So... Yeah, I believe that's it. Um, just a whole bunch of saddles, bridles, bareback pads, all of our tack around here. Whoops. Okay. And then right here, this is the box for the lights that go the whole way around the stables. So, super cool. I think you can see them. Okay, so they go the whole way around the fence. The whole way up and around the barn. These are really cool at night. Whole way around the barn again. The whole way around the back. And then back over here. So, 
Those are super cool. My brother put them on for me. I really like them and they're gonna be really nice. Like they're really cool at night and they're gonna be really cool. They're gonna be extra cool when I decorate my barn for snow. But anyways, back to the tour. So right here we have Jordan and um, he takes lessons here with us and it looks like he was going to clean some dressage tack. So he's just getting that off the rack and going to go and start soaping that. And then on the other side, across from all that, we have our haystack. So just a bunch of random haystack there. And I know the shadows are weird. I have really bad lighting right now. Um, yeah, so anyways. And then we also have a sack of oats. And then this here is Teresa. And she's doing nothing which is what she always does. So, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, and then here we have Ace is Sheet right there because he's being groomed right now. So it's off of him. And now I'm just going to take the roof off my barn really quick so I can show you what's inside. All right, so we are now in the barn and we have a whole bunch of activity in here and it is also super dark in here. So thank goodness my camera is making it look a lot brighter than what it really is. But anyways, so we're gonna start here with this stall. So here we have our, sh our Mustang Philly Flax and she is wearing a blanket by Rocky Mountain Stables. And then this here is her bestie, Spike, and he's our little farm goat, and they are best friends, so they're always in their stall together. And then all the horses all have a hay trough and a little waterer, and then they also have, like, apples or carrots or just whatever they prefer. And, yeah, <laughs> so, yeah, so that's this stall. And then the next stall down, we have our Shire Stallion Clyde and our Shire Philly Autumn. And Clyde is wearing a halter that I bought off of Etsy. Um, I can't remember what the name was. Yeah. Okay, well, if I think of it, I'll let you know, but I can't remember. <laughs> I'm sorry. And I do want to let everybody know that I do understand that in real life, you wouldn't necessarily put a stallion with a foal, especially a filly. But these are just my play horses, and Autumn does not have a mother, so she's with her daddy. But I do understand that in real life, you probably wouldn't do that, okay? So, yeah. All right. <laughs> but yes, this is Clyde and Autumn, and this here is their owner, Christian. And he's going to get Clyde out and probably go for a ride. So that'll be super fun. And then over here, we have Clyde's dressage saddle, and there's also a grain bucket. And then right here we have a Schleich grooming kit. And down here we have little Cookie the kitten. He is so cute. And he's in his little kitten nest. I don't think my camera is focused. But it's really adorable. Anyways, yeah. And then it, here in the middle of the barn, I guess, we have the Ace, our Halflinger Stallion. And he is getting a grooming slash, slash checkup. So here we have Jenny, our groom I guess around here and we have Samuel our veterinarian and Ace is wearing a halter by aqua models I guess a halter and lead rope by aqua models and we have a grooming box that I made and then some brushes by GHS tack shop and then over here on the other side we have two more stalls so out front of this one we have a riding set and this riding set actually belongs to Lizzie so that's her saddle and bridle. And then here we have a Smart Pack magazine that's just randomly laying on top of a grooming box. And then here is Ace again, and he is actually untied. So yeah. All right, so I got that fixed because we definitely don't want to lose Ace. He is so pretty, such a good boy. But anyways, in his stall, so this here is Ace's stall, and his sheet and everything, um, like I mentioned earlier. But in a stall, we have Sarah, and she's cleaning out all the manure because it's a total mess, and she's just gonna get all this cleaned out so he can go back in his stall when he's done with all this out here. <laughs> but yeah, 
So he's getting the stall cleaned. And then over here we have Lizzie and she is tacking Pokey, our Shetland pony mare, out for a little walk because they'll probably just walk because Lizzie is kind of big for her. Um, I actually don't have riders that are small enough, so Lizzie is just going to take her for a walk. But yeah, and she's wearing that super cute tack. Um, super cute pony tack that I made, which she's really adorable in. So I'll just roll around. So, yeah, I'm really proud of that pony tack. Yeah, anyway, it's really cute. And then over here we can see Sarah again and they're hard at work. And then here we have Stephanie and she's got a whole wheelbarrow load of feed for the horses. And this here is Kipper, our farm dog. And he's wearing this really nice dog collar that I made a long time ago. <laughs> and then over here in between the stalls, we have this crate which has our broom um, just for around the barn. And when the pitchfork is not being used, it's stored in here as well. So if you just come up around the barn i guess to the front um we have a tack box full of halters so most of these halters i made but there's some in here by aqua models and some by ghs tech shop and i actually think that's it so they're just a whole bunch of halters for everybody to use and then over here we have some schleich halters on this hitching post and then here we have a show ribbon and a poster that says welcome and then over here on the other side um we have adam and he is just adjusting tronta's blanket and once again this blanket and halter is by aqua models and Tronte is our Lipizzaner, 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 not sure how it's said, but our Lipizzaner mare, and she belongs to Teresa, and she does dressage, and she is so pretty. And yeah, and then she also has a lead rope that I made, and then here are some trot poles, in case anybody is going to practice some trot poles. And then over here we have Leanna, and she's riding her horse, Trickster, our Tennessee Walker Stallion. And she is using a saddle by Schleich Horse Girl 11, a bridle that I made, and a breastplate by CCS underscore Briar underscore Schleich on Instagram. And yeah, so he actually looks really cool because everything matches. And then over here, we have John, and he is riding our horse that is in training. So this is Fury, and he is our Mustang Stallion, and he is my all-time favorite Schleich horse. And John is attempting to train him, so that ought to be very interesting. And all the tack he's wearing is, once again, made by me because I make a lot of my tack. And yeah, so super cool. And then over here we have our wash doll. And in the wash doll we have Christy and she is filling a bucket full of water. And Christy is a custom I did. So she's another, um, uh, she's the same, per she's the same model as Sarah. And they were both the same. So I painted her to be a little different. So she's busy in the wash doll because she's getting ready to give one of our horses a bath. So in this crate, we just kind of have like a little bathing kit, I guess. So we have some shampoo, some treats, a super small bucket with some curry combs in it. everybody so that's my barn tour of my Schleich stables um I know this layout is really small and it's super simple but I really like it and I plan on filming a lot of videos here and yeah so I really hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure you give it a big like and of course subscribe to my channel and yeah so I will see you all next time bye guys